What is a Joseph's injunction? Have you ever wondered how scientists can measure incredibly tiny magnetic fields or even manipulate quantum information? The answer lies in a fascinating device known as the Joseph's injunction. This device consists of two superconducting materials separated by a thin insulating barrier. This barrier is typically made from materials like metal oxides or semiconductors and is only about 1 to 10 nanometers thick. The creation of these junctions involves advanced lithographic techniques that allow for precise fabrication. The concept of the Josephson junction was first introduced by British physicist Brian Josephson in 1962. He predicted that when two superconductors are placed close together with an insulating barrier in between, a supercurrent could flow through the junction without any applied voltage. This phenomenon is referred to as the Josephson effect. In superconductors, electrons pair up to from what are called Cooper pairs. These pairs can tunnel through the insulating barrier found in the Josephson junction. This tunneling process enables the flow of supercurrent across the junction. The Josephson effect is a remarkable example of macroscopic quantum phenomena, showcasing quantum mechanics on a larger scale than individual atoms. The first experimental realization of a Josephson junction took place in 1963 at Bell Laboratories. Philip Anderson and John Roll conducted the experiment using a tin lead alloy as the superconductor and a layer of oxide as the insulator. Their work confirmed the predicted behavior of the Josephson effect, demonstrating the flow of supercurrent without any applied voltage. Josephson junctions have played a significant role in the history of science, especially in the field of superconductivity. They are essential components in superconducting quantum interference devices, often referred to as squids. These highly sensitive magnetometers can detect even the tiniest changes in magnetic fields. This capability has been crucial in various scientific experiments related to superconductivity and quantum mechanics. Moreover, Josephson junctions are vital in the realm of quantum computing, specifically in superconducting qubits. These qubits utilize the unique properties of Josephson junctions to store and manipulate quantum information effectively. In practical terms, Josephson junctions also contribute to defining standards for electrical measurements. For example, the National Institute of Standards and Technology standard for one volt is based on an array of Josephson junctions. This highlights their precision and reliability in ensuring accurate measurements. Overall, the Josephson Junction represents a remarkable advancement in the history of science. Its discovery and development have led to numerous breakthroughs and continue to influence ongoing research in quantum technologies. Understanding this device opens the door to many exciting possibilities in both science and technology.